Hunter College of the City University of New York has been offering personnel preparation programs in the area of blind and visually impaired for over 70 years. We are located right in the heart of Manhattan and we are accessible by all types of transportation. Hunter offers both master's degree programs and advanced certificate programs in the areas of orientation and mobility, teachers of learners who are blind and visually impaired, and rehabilitation teaching. I think a teacher of the visually impaired is a person who works with children who are visually impaired, not only thinking of one aspect of their lives, but the entire person. Part of being a TVI is knowing about their disability, knowing how it affects them. The social emotional piece is huge. It's putting all of that together to get a full picture of the child. Orientation and mobility, o &M, is teaching a blind person what's around them, using their remaining senses, and mobility is getting from place to place safely. The Hunter program was unique. It was small, it was individual, it was very thorough. What I liked about the program is the availability of the classes. They were at night, which if you're teaching, it's really hard to go to day classes. Um, they have a lot of programs online, so you can do that. The professors and the courses really were geared to what you do every day. Being blind myself, I, um, I had an interest in being a teacher of the visually impaired. I had a great teacher of the visually impaired as a kid growing up through school. I had the experience of being blind, so I knew I knew some stuff going in, but Hunter really uh, gave me a lot of the literature, different curriculums. You'll learn Braille, you'll learn the Nemeth Code. They introduced uh, a lot of assistive technology for people that maybe aren't as familiar. They do a good job with that. They really tried to present you with various situations to prepare you for when you're in the classroom. When I was brand new to the program, my first semester, we had field observation. It's been really helpful because I get to see different teaching styles, I get to see different grades. So it really gives you, it gives you a glimpse into what being a teacher can be like, especially, you know, before you student teach. Student teaching um, is really the final component of their experience here and it's the step right before they go out to get their jobs. So we always say to the student, although it's hard to be scrutinized and looked at and evaluated, this is a very important part of the program because here you have an opportunity to reflect on your best practice and really make it even better. We had someone who came to class, saw how we were teaching, gave us ideas of how we could improve. We also discussed lesson plans, how to take into consideration a child's visual needs during um, a class that you might be teaching them. One of the things that I've appreciated most is I've been able to take the things that I have learned at the Vision Program and I've been able to bring them back to the school, to my colleagues, and um, I've been able to speak with the occupational therapists and the physical therapists and other teachers who may have students with visual impairments and share with them the knowledge that I've learned here. What I like teaching about O&M is the individual. It's one-to-one. -one. I like working one-to-one -one with a student. I like being creative with them. I remember reading a story and I said that the child's hair was blonde. And the child asked me, what does that mean? I said, well, it means they have yellow hair. He thought that was hysterical because no one had a hair color like that. So I went back to discuss hair color. And you get into so many things that you don't even think about because we have the vision. But in explaining it to him, you know, he was only in fourth grade and he said, thank you. And so those kind of experiences are very encouraging for me. There's a dire shortage of teachers of learners with visual impairment in New York State. Many of us are getting up in age, we're thinking of retirement, and there are not enough people to replace us. So we need people in this program who can replace us as proficient teachers. It's been great. I am so happy that I chose Hunter. As soon as I graduated, I got a job right away with the Department of Education for a classroom. Um, and every other student in my class was hired right away. It's an excellent field to get into um, in terms of job security. It's very interesting, you need to think on your feet, but the jobs are absolutely there. The Hunter College program in blindness and visual impairment is looking for individuals who would like to have an impact on enhancing the quality of educational and personal lives of children with visual impairments. Scholarships for these programs are available. <laughs>